welcome back folks and welcome back to World of Warship. Today I'll show you something very important. This is Fletcher, my uh, one of the, how should I say, my favorite uh, destroyer, so I enjoy to play her. Uh, I am the captain and we have a huge pleasure to watch me and I'm taking this beautiful Fletcher. Tier 9 US destroyer first spin and it's uh, in uh, Tears of the Dead's domination. I went, I am tried to uh, say to uh, division that, uh, the team that I go for see Many of you guys have uh, been thinking, man, you show a lot of good skill players. How, how you are playing? Well, thanks for asking because you will have the answer right now. And uh, I'm not going to spoil you some. Yes, I will. Folks. May I have pleasure to announce a small um, announcement. This, folks, is the last gameplay I played. Yes, sir. This is the absolutely last game that I played recently. I mean, today and right now. And I want to share with you because it is gonna be interesting. All right. I was kind of lucky over here that my ready position finder, I have, I don't know, it close to 18 points captain about this one. I'll tell you in detail exactly what my build is. If you uh, so wish and want, I'll put uh, some um, in comment below my full build. Uh, yeah, I do believe the Fletcher is a um, hybrid. You can absolutely use your guns, not from far away, from close, but you can uh, spot your enemy and send torps. I do love those tor tor those torpedoes, absolutely amazing. Over here, um, I uh, had a f bad feelings about this. You see, all those ships, they wouldn't push their heart if there's a destroyer or something. You see, I could, I have good consumer, 5.8, I could easily go a whole lot closer but I kind of decide uh, not and when I saw Chapayev, uh, Tirpitz and all there together mm, ah, it's a sneaky business over here and Chapayev it's cl uh, coming a whole lot closer now I do own Chapayev and I do own uh, Tirpitz and Bismarck as well uh, sorry Bismarck so I know what they are capable of now I have this feeling that this uh, Chapayev wants to radar me and this I would do if I would uh, be that close to this cap. So I actually was kind of a smart, very smart play from me, my side to just get the hell out. Oh, what do you know? He raided me. If imagine yourself, if I were be on the other side uh, on this uh, island. Seriously, many of you guys it would just go because you want to torp Izumo and Knights now, whatever. I will be dead. Because Chapayev and all those cruisers and battleships will uh, gun the hell out of me and I will be goner. And I cannot hide in, in the smoke, right? But now they can't, they, they could not. My gut feeling was actually in this side kind of wrong. And I, uh, I typed down to the, the I radar right now. He used the radar so let uh, them know that this uh, Chapayev was kind of a ball to move all the way to the border of the without no support from destroy because um, they, their own destroyer they are at A, B and I was cap, trying to cap C and I did manage to cap C but uh, Chapayev is now going to cap right and look at this, uh, sorry, uh, look at this firepower behind <laughs> good luck Mr. Chapayev and try to cap and my first torpedo on Izumu and Pits. No, I don't know. It was just a widespread. I do apologize about this. I should probably tell you. But yes, I know I, what I'm. What I, I was uh, was just me playing just a couple minutes ago. I was. It was on uh, Izumo. Unfortunately, Izumo is turning the hell out of there, and uh, Terpitz is moving towards me. So they are ba uh, both of them because this is a kind of a corner. I should probably wait with my torpedoes. To be honest with you, I do kind of uh, waste this torpedo wall because none of those torpedo will hit. Uh, but uh, I was not paying attention. I was kind of uh, to probably should come a little bit closer and w wait to the right opportunity. That's my first uh, kind of a mistake. But anyhow, folks, unfortunately we lost A, we lost B, and we have very little ships at A, and just some of them are B, but most of uh, firepower are here behind me. So. 
the thing is uh, folks at the beginning and you will see in the end of this uh, gameplay what the power of uh, Fletcher's uh, detection I decide yes I could pop the smoke yes I could use my guns uh, but I don't I don't want to uh, and remember Terpets has Hydro as well I don't know if the Terpets Hydro got nerfed I don't think so she has amazing good uh, t uh, hydro so she has torpedoes as well six kilometers so I'm kind of uh, too close to be comfortable so I put those salvo towards terpits uh, one little bit uh, in the front and one behind I'm talking about uh, the you see so I create a little bit tight you see how tight the torpedo are don't send all of them at the same time send a little bit you know a little bit one one to the right one to left and that you create a little bit bigger wall of torpedoes uh, but those torpedoes of course uh, folks they don't look bad uh, very strange even though I have so much firepower over here behind or oh, uh, they are very healthy this torpedoes damn he re received very little damage what he received 1000 damage same thing goes with the uh, ism okay he received a little more damage but uh, Pensacola and Knights now all right they're all kind of a uh, healthy uh, compared with how much firepower I have behind yes folks to torpedo it to cause flooding and now these turpets only receive uh, uh, before earlier um, 1000 damage now he has 33,000 and now he doesn't want to deal with me anymore he's get the hell out of here we don't see him for a long period of time uh, over here is tricky tricky situation because the enemy our team are approaching my reload is in 7.5 seconds I don't know what should I engage maybe Izumo maybe Pensacola nice now I went actually for the Izumo to be honest with you. He's a big threat for my uh, team, and I decided to him. Same thing here, folks. I try to make uh, as much uh, wall a as I can, but not too spread either. I would like to hit at least two. Oh crap! I forgot to press the piece of just for a freaking second I was actually spotted now I don't know about my torpedo if they are spotted or or not but I was spotted for f half a second to be honest with you and I press hell fast P I forgot the damn P you know I don't want to uh, I want to be a sneaky bugger you know what I mean those torpedo lo uh, walls kind of looks good Izumu he was avoiding me uh, first time but uh, he won't have avoided me this time Three, three torpedoes and three flooding, folks. That was a pretty good uh, hit. I mean, of course, it always could be better, but you see how wide uh, the torpedo wall. And I decided, uh, folks, uh, pay attention because this is a lot of action. All team are being run now. The A is secure, and my team, where are they? They are all over the place behind me, more or less very few people on the right key have low HP and stuff like that trash can main hand and I kind of uh, nice now there's so many targets I can engage I did not know for a short what the hell to do to be honest with you okay nice now enemy nice now receive kind of a uh, damage and a main hand is popping the smoke oh boy there is okay I actually went for the nice now over here folks because I kind of have a feeling that this captain is going for a strength light this uh, sometimes you feel uh, when they moving how they moving some uh, captain they just go straight and this is how I felt you see what I'm talking about my torpedo looks good and we are way behind points we are more than 280 behind points what we have to do right now we have to cap and we have to do some killings and trash can it's, it's coming very okay I'm spotted oh crap 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 how about I'm opening five I pop the smoke this I pop it right now smoke and I am trying to deal with this trash can he can still spot me okay that salvo was ridiculous bad and I torpedo this nice now and I'm working on this uh, trash can and yes sir I have a double kill I want full, almost full HP. How about she has 55,000 damage? Uh, health, health pool left. And how about I am Fletcher? You don't want to come within 6.8 towards my ship. Why? I have amazing 
um, rate of fire. Even though my guns won't do a whole lot, I will put you on fire and I will give you good looking uh, sh uh, how should I say? shell walls, firewalls, of the firewalls, of the firewalls. And you're gonna see her that this Iowa, she felt kinda comfortable to be around nice now and uh, trash can, they are now more because I killed them. And I put this this wall on the, uh, how should I say, uh, Bismarck. And I'm still engaging this Iowa because I would like to take her down if I can. Maybe put her on fire and some with the help of my friends to take her out of the action because that is the power of Fletcher. Fletcher uses his torps, but he only has guns to use. And okay, uh, Izumo decided to go. Oh man, those uh, torps wall, it was for Bismarck. I I, I, I swear, I, it was for Bismarck. But man, those torpedo walls, uh, because I, I put such a wide spread, I do believe that those looks good. And those looks also for Bismarck. And Bismarck takes two torpedoes. Oh man, only one. She dodged them, but Izumo, she's a big. She eat both of them, and she's dead. Now this uh, Bismarck captain was kind of a lucky. Only eat one torpedo, but I do believe she caused flooding because yeah, it caused flooding because I have nine torpedo and nine floodings. Okay, nobody spotting this um, uh, Bismarck, and my uh, my torpedo, my smoke, it's vanish. It's going down, but oh boy, now. This is uh, far uh, by uh, over. We are still behind the points. We are still don't cap B because there's a lot of ships at B, and I have one, two, three ships at B. And what the hell to do? I cannot come that close. Bismarck will eat meat uh, for breakfast with his secondary. Same thing with Atago. I cannot uh, come to them class. The only thing I did send some torps, and I actually decided to move away a little bit. I kind of uh, need some support from my team, and my team are all behind those rocks. I I I know it sounds kind of weird, but there's a lot of pretty healthy battleship. I'm talking about North Carolina and Frederick de Grosse, which did not quite help, and I asked for help. Come on, uh, guys, come on, learn to play, say, one of the, for real. You know, just look at this chat and I uh, press help, help, help. We kind of need to take B, we are behind points. Hell, we are behind 100 points because I could not cap B. There's too many ships at B, that's the reason I couldn't. And I feel that, that uh, uh, kind of a, my team, they let me down. Even I pressed like a madman, help, 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 SOS, SOS. You know what I mean? I kind of... I know, I could pop the smoke, the problem is if I pop my smoke, nobody will um, spot those enemy, because they are behind rocks, you know, that's what I'm trying to say. I am at B right now, trying to stop them, and uh, kind of feel that, I don't know, I kind of even felt that to, to go towards B, A, sorry, to leave the whole team. And then, maybe, maybe the team will come back, I don't know, they kind of uh, need to help me over here because basically I feel folks that all enemy things are right here at B. I send those tops uh, towards turpets and the, the, the other one just went for I don't know. Uh, I did not know where to aim because I knew that these turpets would turn. Uh, I This was not the smartest drop to be honest with you. I do kind of regret this the torpedo wall. Even though it looks good right now, but uh, the Sturpit is slowing in, it's turning, and the same thing goes with Pansacola, it's kind of a far. Mm. But anyway, I did decide because now I can see the Amagi and uh, Kutuzov and Chapaev are finally come a little bit closer. There's at least Kutuzov that it's kind of a close, and Amagi, sorry, Amagi is the closest one. So Amagi, I do appreciate when I saw the Amagi is that close to B and actually try to help me and engage in this derpits, which is kind of a healthy and kind of a bald, to be honest with you. Um, I, you know, I, de I decided over here, I will tell you exactly what I decided. I decided to um, give my friendly the uh, Kutuzov and especially Amagi a huge surprise. Guess what? Remember folks that uh, 
the strength about Fletcher's not the rate of fire I know I could use my gun but here's the deal I want to actually keep this Amagi alive I want to him to uh, how should I say uh, keep him alive you see he is receiving a lot of uh, shells from enemy and over here folks I'll pop the smoke I'll smoke him up not just him everything behind him I'll smoke him up and I actually pop the speed boost he received a lot of damage he's only have 11,000 damage left right uh, HP left so he really needed to pull back my torpedo also looks good torpedoes it's um, Oh man, he still eat one torpedo and cause flooding and now it's my time. Yeah, this captain was kind of a ball the whole game. He was, uh, whatever, now Amagi safe. Amagi cannot shoot. I put such a huge big smoke. I have the best smoke in the whole game. That basically, uh, my Amagi and my uh, uh, teams behind Amagi can stay and shoot this dude and I shoot him. You see the, the rate of fire just crazy. Okay, he has radar, don't forget, but he needs to go down before he can use the radar. And why the hell not? And now uh, there's uh, uh, Atago and Bismarck as well. And I decided to now I use my freaking guns. You, I know the, why I'm using it right now. Because I have so many friends that they will spot for me. If I put the smoke just uh, uh, before, you can stay in the smoke and nobody... Uh, a spot for you you cannot use a gun that's the reason I did this and now basically folks it's payback because I saving my Amagi and I using my freaking guns you want a piece of me how about I have a piece of you this is how I felt last time because I will kill this uh, uh, Bismarck and will get my Kraken well deserved Kraken thank you very much because I have almost 180,000 damage and high caliber and double kill and Kraken and this is supposed and folks I have a pleasure to announce Kutuzov North Carolina Amag is still alive thanks to me Kutuzov and Chapai, they were all behind the huge big cloud of smoke. You see, I covered the whole freaking uh, uh, side of this. And now it's basically clean up job because, folks, is this how you save your uh, friendly uh, by not vanished? Because let's face it, there was three, four ships uh, versus this poor Amagi. And I saved him with my smoke and I make sure that he survived uh, so he uh, and those others uh, cruiser kind of helped me at the end finally because uh, they kind of uh, said help help for a very long time it's only folks uh, Pensacola left and basically I'm not afraid to use the guns anymore because look at this firepower it's about just a couple more seconds and this game will end folks so close to 176,000 damage I'll hit him a few more times but I do believe that I received very little damage compared to how, how much I gave so thanks guys for watching hope you enjoyed Seven, this one have a uh, 100 million credits 3,369 uh, experience uh, one double strike and uh, Kraken and high caliber 176,000 damage 10 torpedo hits only 165 of which non penetration is 76 that's life 5 kills uh, 5 fires ter 10 uh, floodings and 1 capture the base team wise of course me with 2246 raw experience way way behind uh, everyone in uh, front of anyone and detailed report here uh, let's see here uh, high explosive close to 30,000 torpedo this is the big part torpedo 10 torpedo of which 114,000 torpedo hits fires 13,000 and flooding uh, close to 20,000 so hmm something else kind of a uh, damage upon your spotting 80,000 folks if you see this I'll repeat damage upon your spotting 80,283 what's your main role in uh, this ba uh, this game as a destroyer send the bloody torpedoes and spot the enemy I did both 
because if you put only torpedo without my guns only torpedo with no flooding or stuff like that this combined is 200,000 uh, damage right so I gave torpedo only close 115 and thanks to my spotting 80,000 potential damage that's something else but this is very very important and uh, I had some defense points and capturing the points I already thanks guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this lovely gameplay please subscribe to my channel and catch you in the next battle have a good one bye yeah.